constant vigilance. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Hello everyone! Welcome once again to the Month of the Mystical Fools! Today on the agenda is Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire! I already tried the PC version and, um... It, on a technical level, it was kind of lackluster, if only because the options haven't exactly aged well for me. But it wasn't the worst. It was an interesting new concept with isometrics, but ultimately I prefer the previous ones. But let's see how the Game Boy Advance version does. Uh, press select to create a new game. The Game Boy Advance version has more options than the PC version. Let that sink in. You can actually turn the SFX on and off. You can turn the music on and off. You can even put the damn thing into sleep mode. Now, obviously, that one wouldn't have been very conductive for the PC version, but they could have at least let you turn the music on and off. I'm gonna play as Hermione first this time. They do a pretty good job trying to approximate them. Okay, she has excellent defense, so I, I probably want to go with her. I want to turtle up. That I don't get my ass kicked. Let's be real. Harry Potter and his friends Ron Weasley and Hermione Granger travel by portkey to the Quidditch World Cup Final. You know what, I'm not gonna sound like I'm from Harry Potter, I'm gonna sound like I'm Duke Nukem. Because I want to inject Duke Nukem into it. You got a problem with that? Where they saw Ireland defeat Bulgaria. You mean I gotta do more of this? Later that night, a gang of Death Eaters followers of Lord Voldemort rampaged across the campsite. Somehow. Uh, don't ask how. Seriously, I don't know what I'm doing here. Arthur Weasley sent Harry, Ron, and Hermione back to the port key. Saving game. Game saved. Get to the port key. These trunks are blocking us. We need to cast with Guardium Leviosa to move them. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Sorry, I had to. Hold down B to cast Wingardium Leviosa! Awesome. Yeah, it's more simple looking as I... As I predicted, it does indeed look a little bit more like Diablo 2. Even down to the fact that it uses pre-render 3D. Pretty bots beans! Green beans can be used to purchase items from Fred and George. Silver beans will give you protection. Why does this seem a lot more cohesive than the PC version? I mean, no offense, but for some reason, it seems like everything's better together. Although I think it also came out on consoles. I know there was a PSP version that's just flat out worse looking. And this is of course a 2D version. We've got to push that card out of the way. Try casting Ventus. Cast Ventus, press A. Get back to the port key! I was about to say. No problem. <laughs> okay, no enemies so far, it's kind of funny. It's more of a slow burn than in the PC version. The Death Eaters are back! Keep moving! Whether or not that's a good thing depends on who you ask. If we all cast from Guardian Leviosa, we should be able to move it. Press L to ask your friends for help. Then hold down B to cast from Guardian Leviosa. That's right, Ron. Well done. Chocolate fro frogs will replenish the group's stamina. Nice. There we go. Can I, can I still abuse Ron? Okay. It just harmlessly smashes against his head. See, Ron, you're not hurt. Everything's fine. I can just... I can mess with you even more in this version. What are you doing here? It's not safe. Get away from the campsite and watch out for dug bugs. Yeah, the PC version basically just threw you in. Do you reckon we can open that chest? I think so. Try casting Alohomora at it. Press A to cast Alohomora. 
Uh, okay. I guess you just cast whatever context-sensitive spell you want. It's like in the, the PC versions of the first three Harry Potter games. We need to watch for the duck bugs to emerge and then cast Confundus at them. Press A to cast Confundus at the Dug Bugs. You can also get rid of Dug Bugs by dropping objects on top of them. Come on, you jerk. That's better. Uh-oh. Not cool, man. Not cool. That's just not cool, man. That's not cool. Ah, darn it. Oh, boy. Oh, so much for that. Come on, Doug boy. Dig Doug now, please, underground. New card unlocked. Good work. Get to the port key. Hopefully we'll make it alive. Nice walking animation. <laughs> Hello, Hamora. Footage, World Cup Stadium. I love how different this game looks compared to the PC version. I'm gonna say main versions, I guess, because it's technically supposed to be the same across all platforms except for this one. That's why these two are the only ones I'm playing. Because if there are any ver differences between the versions, you know I'll play it. But this one doesn't seem to have any differences between its versions, aside from the Game Boy Advance version, which is basically just the same thing in 2D. So it's not that different. Take this. A monster? We need to get the hell out of here. Try Wizard Shield. Collect Try Wizard Shield to unlock bonuses. Cool. Oh, I see. Okay, I can't move it out of the way because I'm currently in the way. That's better. No, nope, I can't move it. Maybe I need help. Maybe I need them to help me. There we go. That's probably why. I was trying to move that big-ass box by herself. What are you thinking, Hermione? I know I made you do it, but I blame you. One out of seven. Just whatever context-sensitive button. Oh, Truckles. If we can get them out of the tree stumps, we might be able to get rid of them. Casket Fundus of the tree stumps. Once the bow truckles are out of the stumps, press A to cast Confundus at them. Take this. Little jerks. A new card unlocked. Ah, oh, darn it. You suck. Ah, crud. Good, now move. The Death Eaters are back. Let's just get out of here. Saving game. I think we made it. Or not. I don't know. Can we even beat them? Did you help me kill this thing? Okay, I guess we can. We just have to get out of its way. I guess all we can do is go forward. Oh, jeez. Well, Hermione just got knocked down her ass. That's brilliant. How do you get out of this? Oh. Why are you all still here? You should be at the port key. Sorry, Dad. Look, the Ministry Wizards need my help. Get to that port key and look for look out for Death Eaters. They're casting spells everywhere and you don't want to get hit. Got it. Yeah, I kind of figured that out. Let's go to the port key, wherever that is. Obviously, it's away from them. Let's just go away from them for now. Dad! Ron, please get this thing off me! Okay, come on. Ron? Harry? 
Are you gonna help her or not? I mean, Ron's dad is only getting crushed by a giant boulder. I guess that's not urgent at all, is it? Jerk. Good, I can feel my legs. Now get moving. You got it, sir. Gotta get away from those Death Eaters. However, these things are easy to kill. So let's just kill as many of them as we can. Ah, darn it. That's not what I thought it was. It's the crawlers, it's the diggers. They'll dig dug all over your soul, man. Dig dug mount, please, underground. Dig dug mount, please, under... Okay, give me that chocolate frog. Thank you. It's not safe here. No shit. Anyone ever remember... Uh, I think it was Arnold Schwarzenegger in that one movie? No shit. <laughs> Sorry, had to. Freaking Death Eater's always ruining my picnic. Ah, humbug. Yo, sack. Hello there, Mr. Potter. Don't mind if I grab the cardo. The raw monster cardo. Now I'm Yugi. Or at least I'm the better Yugi. Don't tell him I said that. I think it's the port key. The Death Eaters are blocking us. Stupefy. You've collected a collector's card. Well, of course, I'm the king of games, bitches. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm the boy who lived. A new term at Hogwarts. Hogwarts this year will play host to the Triwizard Tournament. Please join me in welcoming our guests. BX Payton's Acad Acad Academy of Magic and Proud Sons of Durmstrong. I don't know how to pronounce words properly. May I introduce Professor Moody, your new Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher. Now, he's a Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher, which clearly means there's something wrong with him. I mean, come on, we have a bad track record with that. One of them was literally ho hosting Lord Voldemort, the other one was a fraud, and the third one was basically a werewolf, so... Something's wrong with him, I know that much. You know immediately that there's something wrong with him. Oh, I guess I'll go with Harry Potter, even though he doesn't have much in terms of defense. You would think the boy who lived would have a lot of defense, but I guess not. Whatever. Harry, Ron, and Hermione met Mad-Eye Moody for an extra defense against the Dark Arts lesson. I've got my eye on you. Yep, it pretty much is the other version, but in 2D. And like I said, it's... If you're to survive my classes this year, you'll need to brush up on your skills. Constant vigilance. Do you understand me? Okay, I guess we're going with something a little different this time. Cool, a red cap. If we turn our backs, it might come closer. Cool. Let me take the red cabin of the cauldron. Awesome. Sounds fun. Darn it. Get closer, you little freak. Come on. You underestimated me. Big mistake, pal. And that was the last mistake you'll ever make. Come on, you little freak. Come on. I see you there. Did you think you could get the drop on me, the boy who lived? You are a fool. Thank you, Hermione. Glad to know someone around here is competent besides me. Ron, I'm talking about you. Gotta step it up, boyo. Awesome. Saving game, please wait. What is that thing? It's an Urkling! Avoid the musical notes coming from the Urkling's flute. Okay, so there are some drastic differences. Eskin Fundus of the Urkling. It would be a little bit difficult. 
Okay. Ah, uh, that's great. Mind a little weirdo. Jerk. Okay, I just keep getting stunned by it. Anyone want to help? At some point in the future? Before we all die? You know, that would be a nice concept, wouldn't it? Oh, come on. A little help here. Are you two just standing still? Okay, there we go. Yeesh. Huh, neat. Oh, that's cool. That is really cool right there. Using a little bit of 3D perspective, are we? Yeah. No, now we're talking. Ah, great, it's this thing again. Two of them? I can barely handle one of them. Oh boy, this is bad. This might be a little bad. Oh boy. Oh great, now Hermione's gonna die. If you're not me, you suck. That's just uh, how the game goes. Well, even more than usual. I mean, I suck, but I don't suck as bad as the, in the AI tends to. Ah, uh, great. Damn you. Damn freaks. I'm already not a fan of them. As charming as this version looks, I already despise those things more than anything in the other in the PC version. In the main version. The chocolate frogs do certainly help to ease the pain. Don't they? Huh. Almost looked like the grand staircase there for a second. I guess I just got my hopes up. Real shame. Oh, it's one of these. Cool. I guess that was in one level that you find seven of them in. Darn it. Have to let them get a little closer. My bad, I forgot what button did what. I may have confused it for the PC version. There is a slight chance. Maybe. Take this, you freak. Yes, very good. Uh, thanks. I appreciate it. Those barrels seem to have chocolate frogs in them, typically speaking. Well, except for that one. Come on, you guys want to be helpful instead of... What? Uh, that's not the way, Hermione, but uh, thank you. Awesome. Ah, crap. Well, to its favor, the levels seem to be shorter. And overall, it's more cohesive than the main version. Like, it's, it's a preference thing. It has what I consider to be the most annoying enemy so far. But as a whole, I'd say it's smoother. So yeah, do you prefer one really super annoying enemy or just overall feeling less cohesive? Ah, uh, okay, that's great. I guess I can't smash that. That's a shame. Kinda, oh wait, I'm an idiot. It literally just showed that before. Yeah. Gotta do literally the exact same thing you did before. It's not that complicated, but I have to make everything complicated. For reasons. Right, if you're not lifting something, it's A. Everything that doesn't require you to lift something is A. 
about me? What is with these things? Tell them I hate them. Tell them I hate them. At least your your wand auto aims to some extent. If you're not directly in front of them, it will veer. I didn't say all the way, but some extent. They seem to have a knack for stunning you. Oh boy, there we go, one of them's down. And that makes two of them. Oh. Not over yet, is it? Little bastards. See what I mean? There's where it auto-aims to some degree. We'll tilt it in your favor. You jerk. New card unlocked. Eh, whatever, at least I killed you. Ron, if you don't help, I'm just gonna smash this across your head. Is that okay? Eh, who cares? I'm doing it anyway. I forgot, it doesn't do anything in this version, sadly. Be fun, though. That's all I'm saying, just... Let me smack Ron about, around a bit. And maybe Hermione, too, if I'm feeling up to it. Oh, cool. Well, uh, you tried, Ron. I would say it's all that matters, but that's clearly not true. What the? This isn't working, and that's the only thing I know how to do. Great, these guys again. They just never get enough of me, do they? They're broken. Reparo. Try casting the Reparo spell on them. I was just about to, actually, apparently. Oh, that's better. I guess repair arrow is now the same as the lift button. There's now another use for the B button. Cool. Oh, good. Shield. And a card, apparently. Super. Now, what was that about? Was there any point to this? Or was that literally it? I'm sorry, what? Where do I go? Oh, okay, cool. Huh. Now you can cast Repero on armor. Awesome. Darn it. Yeah, damn it. Let's repair it and destroy it all over again. Just because. I can. Well, I can't, but I wish I could. Let's just repair these things, then. Just to get stuff. Oh, okay, cool. Got to get past. Hold down B to levitate the burning torch in the blockage. Eh, <coughs> fire, fire, eh, fire, fire, eh. I am Cornholio, eh. <coughs> I am the Wizard King! I am Cornelio! <laughs> I am the Wizard King! I need the magic of TP for my bone hole! <laughs> yeah, so cool! <laughs> yeah. It's like gonna kill my throat and stuff. Well, then maybe you should quit doing it, butt munch. I hear butt munch! <laughs> What we're we talking about? Okay, you're you're a jerk. Ron and Hermione are borderline useless because that's how AI works, especially on GBA. But then they weren't exactly smart cookies on the PC version either. Though that says something. Cool. Not that I have any right to talk. Though I will try anyway. Let's do this thing. Where am I actually supposed to go? I want to know where I am supposed to go so that I can go where I want to go. Oh, Hedwig, cool. That's nice. 
Okay, let's just shoot the tre treasure chest open and then we'll be on our merry little way, won't we? Awesome. Not bad. There is a certain charm to this. Ah, oh boy. Ah, you jerk. Damn it. Oh, you suck. You suck. Oh, boy. Ah, darn it. Ron and Hermione, you continue to be basically a sitting duck. Thanks for nothing, Hermione and Ron. You two sure are showing how useful you are. Ah, crap. Darn it. You suck. Okay, go screw yourself. Get dipped into the cauldron and just die. Die a horrific death, why don't you? Yeah, that's what I thought, asshole. That's what you get. You're tag team and me, mother fricker. Really? There's more of them? There's seriously more of them. Awesome. Why are there this many of them? Do you have to do it in a certain order or what? Beautiful. Jerks. Well, at least I'm getting chocolate frogs out of it, so not bad. It heals me and it probably tastes really good. I already theorized that it's probably a soft chocolate because the frogs have the appearance of moving their bodies. Yes, that's it. The frogs appear to be able to move their bodies, so you would think that they're of a softer kind of chocolate, that it wouldn't be frigid, it wouldn't be brittle kind of chocolate. It wouldn't be hard chocolate, in other words. It would taste soft. Now what do I do about this? I don't know. Maybe we gotta take one of these giant cauldrons and do it. Come here, come here, come here! Come here, Azul. I don't know what I'm doing. But then again, I never do. Okay. Expecto cooperation. Yeah, I can expect it all I want, that doesn't mean it's gonna be true. I can't see anything. I don't see anything useful. Wait, maybe... Oh, it... Did it tell me and I just didn't notice it? Got it. Damn these things. I hate these things so much. I guess you jerk. Alright, just come on over. Good thing they get stunned for a second. That makes it easier. Good work. Don't forget to practice what you've learned. And remember, constant vigilance. Yeah, whatever. Names for the Triwizard Tournament had been placed in the Goblet of Fire. Only one champion can win the Triwizard Tournament, and that champion must survive three very dangerous tasks. Your three champions are... Vic Victor Crumb, Flower Delacour, and lastly, Cedric Diggory. Hmm, what's this? It's plot convenience! Harry Potter! There were only supposed to be three, but somehow he cheated. Forbidden Forest, okay, that's gonna have to be next time. And that's gonna have to be it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like spells and Diablo mechanics. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day, Mr. Potter. See you later. 
If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.